Hello, welcome to this video on PVSD Twitter. In this video, we'll be looking at biology, plus here on uh, the dentition or the structure of the tooth. Figure 3.0 shows a diagram of the tooth. A1 says identify the type of the tooth shown in figure 3.0 above and state its functions so what type of the tooth is this now you can identify the type of the tooth by the roots this just got two roots and then look at the upper part there the the the, the enamel they are more like doubled so this can only be a molar the type of the tooth is a molar and the function of the molar is used for crushing and grinding of food. That's the function of the molar. Two says label on the diagram the following parts of the tooth: the blood capillaries. So the blood capillaries are these. Sorry, you pardon me there. Those inside, just around the, that's where you label. Then the dentine, the dentine is the interior there. Just that space. Let me draw it properly. Just this space. Yes, that's the dentine. This is the dentine. Let me call it D. And this is the blood capillaries. Those inside there. Those are the blood capillaries. Then B1 says, mention two elements or ions which enter part F. You can see what part F is to perform its functions more efficiently. Now, part F is the enamel. And the enamel, there are two uh, elements. We have calcium. Also have um, iron. Just, these are some of the elements or ions that enter the G. Also one of them is phosphorus for making it stronger and performance function properly. To say suggest how tooth decay can be brought about. How is tooth decay brought about? So here this one is just two marks so you need to be careful with with what you mention. So I'll wrap everything. How is toothy decay brought about? One, by by food particles. In short, let me just do this. Tooth decay is as a result of fermented Food particles that remain in the teeth gap that remain in the teeth gaps producing acid which eat up. The enamel. So that's what happened. It's the, due to the fermented food particles that uh, that remain in the tooth gaps, producing acids which eat up the enamel. I give one way in which tooth decay can be prevented. How can we prevent tooth decay? They're just saying give one way on which you can prevent tooth decay by the lot. One of the one of the ways is by brushing tooth regularly. So brushing tooth. Regularly. Also by reducing the intake of sugary food.
also by visiting a dentist regularly for tooth checkups so they're a lot actually also eating food rich in calcium phosphorus and sodium so thank you so much this is all what we have for today previously to what i'll see in the next video